All right, y'all, here's the continuation of my last video. I'm going to show you from start to finish how you're going to properly sew your bundles in with a frontal sew-in. Once again, this is the Raw Virgin Straight Hair from HairByErikaJ.com. The last step that we did before the video ended was put the mousse on the hair and wrap the frontal down. The frontal is going to stay wrapped down for the whole entire sew-in process. Please pay attention to how I'm sewing in. If you are familiar with my videos and you have seen me make my wigs by hand, this is the same exact process. Watch this video as many times as you need to. Take notes, practice, repeat until you are completely confident and you have this down pat. Whenever you're starting, you're always going to go through the weft two times. Whenever you're ending and getting ready to flip over or move on to the next row, you're going to complete that same process. Through the weft two times whenever you're ending, through the weft two times whenever you're beginning. Please remember that. This is what I'm about to do when I'm ending the needle. This is very hard to do for a beginner, so I'm gonna show you something that's very beginner friendly. This is just easier for me, and this is what I'm used to doing. It's kind of like automatic, so it's really easy at this point. But please stay focused, stay tuned, and don't forget to subscribe, leave a comment, and hit the like button. Roughly, it takes about 30, 35 to 40 minutes to do the sew-in process, but it honestly just depends. Sometimes it's really like 25, 30 minutes at the most. That's because I'm used to doing this. It's like so easy now, but when you first begin, it's going to take some time, but do not get discouraged. Just stay focused, keep up the momentum, stay motivated, and stay neat. Here's the beginner friendly tip when it comes down to ending your needle. You're going to cut the thread and make knots. You could do two knots, you could do three knots. Right now I'm on the second bundle. The inches that I am using is a 16 inch frontal, 16, 18, and 20 inch bundles. Another thing that you must know, you're never going to sew on your lace at all because when it comes down to you replacing the frontal, instead of taking the whole sew-in out, you can go back in and replace the frontal. Soon I'm going to do one of those on my channel. 
I just need to wait for one of my clients to come back and get a new frontal. But you're never going to sew on the frontal because when you take the frontal off, you don't want the rest of your sewing unraveling. So never sew on the frontal. Just sew directly in front of it as close as you can get without going on the frontal. And we're on the last bundle, the 16 inch. Make sure you do not sew on the frontal. Please keep that in mind. Now the sewing is complete. I hope you enjoyed this video. She still has hair left over. My bundles come very full, very thick and long. Three bundles can fit, but it just depends on the person's head size. You don't want a bulky sewing. You want it to be flat. You want it to be neat. This is the results. Once again, I hope you enjoyed this video. I've removed the head wrap and this is what it should look like, completely melted. If you like these results and you want these results, shop at hairbyericaj.com. Follow my steps, follow every single thing that I did. And right now, I'm just going to cover the tracks with the frontal.
Once again, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe.